You can share with me. Thank you. I'll warn you, my chromosomal DNA knowledge is non-existent at best. <laughs> Crash, are we get social one that's all. <laughs> Smart and funny, I'm impressed. Layla Keating, Beverly Hills resident sweet home. Dad's some big time record producer. And I heard they spent every Thanksgiving with the Obamas. And rumor has it she even spent pot with Rudy last year. Sushi on Friday? It's a date. Our friends tell me Be careful, she's a crier. Oh, shut up, you're cool. Okay, yeah, says the new guy. It's shocking, I know, but. No one's super eager to hang out with Sober Girl post rehab, so. Rehab? Elaborate. Uh, I just went down a bad path. I tried to drown it out with pills. Parents freaked, and here I am. 75K, and 90 days later, I'm, I'm good as new. It hurts. It's fine now. Is it? You're the first person to even ask me that. Welcome to Beverly Hills, Spencer. Somebody knew you put me in the past. I don't even know if my memories will last. But if I change, I'll take care of it. Um, Spencer and I'll just meet you there. You'll always have a chance. Don't you clean up nice? You know, you're good at this. Hemming pants? No. Making people feel better. When you hear our song Do you brush it away or do you say Oh, uh, sorry if I interrupted you guys. I didn't I mean, hey, why stop now? Do you Next up. Keep you fitting in with the cool kids. I don't know about all that. Oh, I don't. Olivia, I see the way you look at him. Yeah, kind of like the way he looks at you. Hi. Hi. <laughs> You got this. And I don't mean to be selfish, but my heart breaks every time that I see you smile. You two like good together? We're not together, Layla. You know this. Oh, maybe if he knew you liked him. Go skinny dipping in the jacuzzi. Olivia Baker. Hi, right, good morning. What? I was just saying hi. Hi. But if I chance it doesn't work out with her, you'll always have a chance. I like them. He likes you. Is it so wrong of me to hope she breaks your problem is her not so sisterly feelings for you? <laughs> Man, whatever. All right. All right, look, maybe for like a second when I first moved here, I thought she might have been feeling you, but it turns out it was nothing. Ah, uh, it was something. It still is. So how you been? What? I feel like we ain't talked in a while, and that's on me. I know you've been busy. Yeah. All this. Look, I'm sorry I didn't tell you about me. It's okay. Really, congratulations. I just missed talking to my friend. Me too. Hey. You good? Yeah. It's okay. I left you like three messages. Post rehab, Spencer is the only person who asked if I'm really okay. All of you just assumed I was and moved on. Beverly's <laughs> <laughs> my home too. 
Yes, I just need a reminder of that. <laughs> I need someone I can count on. He should know better. Not all guys can read minds, Liv. You can. Yeah, but I'm special. Lost a couple of pieces when I carried it, carried it, carried it home. I'm afraid of all I am. The mind feels like. Hey, I'm proud of you. You come a long way since we first met, and you don't need no award to tell you that. But I guess it couldn't hurt to have one. Oh, and your podcast is fire too. And not just because you mentioned my name. Just know there's always a spot next to me on this couch. Same time every night. Alright. I'll be here. Good, Spencer, I promise. Okay. Came back to check on you. Me? Yeah. With everybody bouncing for the summer and joining with Simone, we pretty much all each other's guy. I, I thought it was alone. Hey. You ain't never alone. You always got me. fact that you've been avoiding me these last couple of weeks. I must have missed the part where you came looking for me. <sighs> Touche. I was just trying to give you space. You told me you went to see him after leaving me in Vegas. Kind of like how you told me you and Layla got back together that same trip. Right after I left. You're right. And sometimes talking things out doesn't make them better. <laughs> Look at the two of us. I just want you to be happy. We got real close this last year, and we helped each other through a lot. And I know this summer changed some things, but I miss my friend. I miss my friend, too. I'm sorry, Spencer. 
I mean, you took that bullet for me, and now you have to deal with all the fallout. No, no. just because I got shot don't mean you don't want to blame. And I'll do it again. Whatever's in those letters, you're strong enough to handle. What really happened in Vegas this summer? What are you gonna do all day? Right, chill in this crazy ass suite, watch dumb movies. Without me? Not cool. Yeah, well, I guess you should have come there. Live. Let's have some fun. It's Vegas, baby. Nice hair, by the way. Nice of you to notice. Maybe she's waiting for your dumb ass to make a move. There's a nicer way to say that. You're a take charge kind of guy, Spencer. So take charge. Let her know how you're feeling. Get her a gift or something. Gosh, this necklace is beautiful. He isn't looking for a gift. He's looking for clarity. A forever love. He's here for a girl. And a girl is here for him. Yeah, maybe it's not too bad. Psychic was right about one thing. I needed clarity. I got it now. Watching movies with you all summer, or maybe it's been since my first day at Beverly, and I just ain't realized it, but I know now. I'm in love with you. But there's a reason you're here with me now, okay? There's a reason we're together. Look at Jordan and Simone. If today taught me anything, it clarified for me that if you got a chance at real happiness, Listen to me. You coming here was not a mistake. And me kissing you was not a mistake. Us being together would not be a mistake, Liv. Look, I know you feel the same way. So please, don't leave things like this. Olivia, um, man, that's my day one. You know, she the first person I met when I got to Beverly. Mm -hmm. We uh, shared a laptop and bonded over a chromosomal DNA. <laughs> I don't know, man. We just vibe over everything. It's hard to explain, you know. We just uh, we just get each other. I guess that's why it was so easy to jump in front of her when I saw that gun. That type of trauma can bond two people for life. You think she's my stuck point? No. Your feelings for Olivia aren't complicated, they're clear. You're in love with her. It's time you go for what you want. Or who? You don't value anyone or anything once it gets in the way of what you want. That's not true. Really? Because when Spencer first got to Beverly, you intentionally got him drunk and almost ruined his football dreams. And then you tried to get me to hook up with him until you realized that you just wanted him for yourself. And then suddenly my feelings just didn't matter anymore. Sorry that I didn't respond to your text earlier. I didn't mean to <laughs> leave you in some weird three dot ransom all day. It's all good. It's not, but I'm gonna fix it. I love you too, Spencer. and how I feel about you. I just want to be clear. I don't know why I love you. I don't know why I stay. I don't know if it's worth the pain.
None of that's changed. If you've been drinking for months, Liv. But it's it's not a big deal. You falling off the wagon is a big deal, Olivia. You need help. You nearly died last time. Do you want to see me sent off to rehab again? Because that's what'll happen if I tell them. It's not fair, Liv. It wasn't just one drink. Liv has been drinking since the summer. She was drinking last night. You strong enough to fight this, Liv. You strong enough to go home and face your family, I believe that. But it don't mean nothing if you don't believe it for yourself. I'm so sorry. I can't believe I did that to you. You deserve so much better. Are you gonna be okay? Every time I start to close the door, you knock. And I let I have people waiting for me to come back. Next coffee, I want all the tea on YouTube. No. And before you even try to deny it, I have eyes. If you take your mind off everything by helping me, win-win. And that way you don't have to plan the party by yourself. Win again. <laughs> we can get our favorite cake. What's our favorite cake? You are brave, inspiring, and beautiful. Do not let these anonymous cars online ever make you doubt that. So no gouging out my eyes? What, those pretty eyes? Crazy. You made me feel a lot better. You've done that before, too. Hey, listen, I know the day was rough, but thanks for pushing through it. I couldn't have done anything without you, including make this cake. That cake was all you. I didn't do anything. Thanks for helping me see that. So, um, you and Spencer are friends, still just friends. You're staying out of other people's business, okay? We're focusing on our own. Please tell me it's not the dark chocolate one. Oh no. Spencer is all loose. Wow, she's stunning. Yeah. Yeah, she is. She's going after what she wants. Will you and Liv alone, no parents? We don't need all the details, bro, but something definitely happened, right? Yeah. We just made out of the park, that's all. What you mean that's all, bro? Spill. She's in recovery. Relationships are discouraged that early. I'm not trying to complicate things for her. Those her words are yours. We agree that we got caught up in the moment and we're not making it a big deal, right? I got you. You know, the party's downstairs. I know. Figured I'd still a minute with you. Make sure we good. We are. Okay, full disclosure. I got a little worried because I ain't seen you since Bracey. Promise you, I'm not avoiding you. Cause I ain't losing my best friend over one night at a frat party. Well, my recovery comes first. 
as it should. But with the right person who really knows you and wants the best for you, it still will. Why did you fall back after Grace did? And just forget about what we said about being caught up in the moment. The truth. Because your recovery comes first. I won't compromise that for nothing. And what if I told you that I could be with you and still put my recovery first? I don't. Um, <clears throat> I say it's about damn time we got our shot at happiness. My school and my brother against my dad and my. I can't even say it. My boyfriend. Mm. There. Mm. Happy? Yes. I just like hearing it out loud. Hey guys, can I join you? Um, yeah, grab a seat. Yep. Actually, I'm gonna roll out. This is gonna be a huge surprise to you but Spencer and I are together, like a couple. Is this supposed to be your surprise face? Girl, no, it's my about damn time face. What are you so stressed about? This is supposed to be the fun part. She brought you into it, so it's a good start. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Okay. Remember you asked me if this felt weird? It started to feel weird. That's the second time you pulled away from me in public. Are we keeping this relationship a secret? No, no, I'm just... I'm in my head. Okay, I want everyone to know how I feel. I... Let's start now. Jay. Simone, let me holler at you. That's... Yo, uh... Mom almost had me choked up there. I'm like, I don't like She's good at that. Listen, we got something to tell you. Ooh. Okay, what's up? Boy, they are holding hands right now. Okay, so y'all, whoa. <gasps> so, why are you guys like, boyfriend and girlfriend now? not putting a label on. Yes. Right. No, he's my boyfriend, and I'm gonna kiss him now. Ah, you can't oh. wait for me to walk away. No. Mm -hmm. Congrats on all of this. Appreciate it. Congrats. 